For most of Southern Sudan's history, the people have known oppression, persecution, and civil war. The generations of the 80s, the lost boys and girls of Sudan, have come of age in refugee camps or on foreign soil. In 1986, three years into Sudan's second civil war, SPLA leadership selected 600 children between the ages of 8 and 13 for a special mission. Daniel Madit Tonduap was 13 when his journey began. The war started in, in 16 May. 16 May, like today, 1983, 25 years exactly. The war started and I had to move out from the town, move back to Duke, the village. Uh, I spent a few months in, in the village. Then I left with my father to Ethiopia to join um, the SPLM movement, Sudan People Liberation Movement and Sudan People Liberation Army uh, in December 1983. Amid the aftermath of war and devastation, the Sudanese children continue to play, laugh, and sing. Their joyful spirit reminds us that even in the midst of tragedy, there is hope. But without adequate water, food, education, and health care, the people face preventable illnesses like malnutrition and malaria. Daniel and his colleagues have returned to southern Sudan in answer to prayer. A prayer for healing. A prayer for hope. A prayer for the future of new Sudan. While prayer is the foundation, the work of rebuilding a nation continues and the health care system is only the beginning. Daniel and 14 colleagues have left the comforts of the West for this purpose, to fulfill a mission of hope and healing. They have set themselves to the task not because they were commanded, but because compassion and the mission compelled them. We knew that we were mission, a mission, and that mission has to be accomplished. And it was a God-given opportunity, so there was no chance to, to, to lose that opportunity. We could not even think twice. I Once Was Lost is a feature-length documentary about the men and women working for a secure and stable South Sudan, the best hope for ending the violence and genocide. Your tax-deductible donation will help raise awareness and increase the impact these doctors will have. Join the team at www.worldimpact-now.com.